what's going on ladies and gentlemen monkey flop here and today usually we talk about rumor and speculation and i will get to that towards the end of the video it's about the playstation 4 4.50 update getting jailbroken and hacked but before we get into all that i kind of wanted to review and give you my opinion on the 4.5 update now i've talked about it in live streams and People have been giving me their feedback as well. Since I actually made the tutorial, uh, they've updated it. <laughs> Monkey flop. Yes, they've updated it. So if you go into settings um, and you go into themes, I just wanted to cover this really quickly. Just in case you guys saw my previous video, you don't have to go into the capture gallery. But, you know, you, you can still go into the capture gallery and, and tweak some stuff and do some pretty cool stuff, gnarly stuff. But if you just wanted to go into your screenshots... This is pretty much where it's going to be. So go to select theme and then scroll all the way down to custom. And then you can select a random image. Okay. Uh, any image at all. We're going to select fruit ninja. Get on my level, bro. Uh, fit to screen or, you know, fill screen. You can actually adjust it, which is pretty cool. Now I recommend screenshots. I don't recommend trying to do it any other way because it's going to look like dog poop otherwise. And this was taken on the PlayStation VR. So PlayStation VR when you're viewing it on the helmet it looks good but when you're viewing it on the tv it's like low res so that's why it kind of looks low res but that being said that's pretty cool i mean uh the fact that they did that is pretty awesome and dang it i made the tutorial and i uh, actually had it scheduled to upload like later on and then uh, um <laughs> and then they come out with the the new way of doing it. i think they just like boop i added this little thing okay so the next one up is actually external hard drive uh support now a lot of people have been requesting this a lot of people have been asking for it and the fact that it's finally here is awesome one thing that sucks though is keep in mind you can't do 2.0 usb it has to be 3.0 so i have linked some in the video description now i don't you know I won't recommend one certain brand or one certain one to go off of. Just go go with the link that I provide you and look it over. Maybe go through a couple of pages of, you know, U.S. Uh, external hard drives. with. A, make sure it says 3.0, okay? That's very important. Um, and, and then just go through them and see what your cup of tea. Read some reviews. The thing is, if you're shopping online, you, you get the chance to actually read reviews. So that's pretty cool as well. And, uh, you know, I always recommend shopping smart, shopping on a budget. You don't always have to get the biggest and best thing. If uh, two terabytes is good for you and it fits your gaming needs, you know, you need a little bit extra storage, but you don't need a crazy amount um, because you don't have like 500 games. I have two terabytes and I have 150 games stored on my PS4 right now. And I'm perfectly happy with it. Uh, that gives me enough room to, you know, if I if I needed to actually add more games, I can delete some. But are you going to play 150 games um, within a month? Most likely not. So uh, two terabytes is good for me. It fits my needs and it's affordable. Uh, but you can be a baller and go with the eight terabyte, you know, no judgment. Maybe you do have like 500 games or something. I don't know. But that being said, the link to that will be in the video description and is always in the comment section below because some people are too lazy to click down, but they like to read through comments. So that being said, I wanted to go over one thing that I'm pissed off about. Okay, but first, let's go ahead and get into friends. Now, I do add everybody that requests me. I do have, I have reached my limit pretty much of uh, 2,000 friends if once i add these uh pretty cool awesome people um you know i always add people so if i see a friend request i add them um you know so that being said one thing um that i i really love is uh the fact that you know if you know your ex-girlfriend tries to friend request you on playstation network you can press the option button and delete friend requests that's pretty cool and uh <laughs> other than that i mean get freaking messages right playstation you, you're really good at organizing the playstation network store you're really good at all of that but why in the hell do i have party chats in my messages it's so freaking annoying 
this party chat right here, uh, which whoever you are, you're you're uh, probably a pretty awesome dude, but 64, 67, excuse me, people are in this party chat right now. Every time somebody comments, I get a new notification. Every time somebody comments, it, it comes out on my messages. So if somebody actually wants to message me, I have to shift through all, sift through all of these different ones in order to actually find a real message, which I think is a problem. Okay, this guy is asking, is this game fun? Um, and, you know, I have to go through all of these uh, <laughs> party notifications, uh, party chat notifications to actually see it. Uh, what is this guy saying? Rain drop, drop top. Monkey's hair looks like a mop top. Just kidding, I love your videos. I keep up the good work. What the heck, bro? <laughs> That's ridiculous. That's funny, though. That cracked me up. I'm going to have to share that with somebody. Um, but that's one of the things it's like you're really good at organizing why don't you organize messages why can't why just i want to get rid of all the party party chats um i'm not in any party chats and i can sure you can remove them uh, but you can leave the group but people keep adding me in and, and, and it just keeps going on and on and on and on and on so anyways enough of me rambling on the playstation 4 4.5 has been jailbroken now i'm not going to go into details because honestly i don't pay attention to that crap um <laughs> if you hack if you jailbreak cool um if that's your cup of tea whatever for me no it's not i i like to go with uh sony's terms of service but i wanted to give you guys a heads up uh it has been already jailbroken a lot of people have actually been reaching out to me monkey flop you know it's already been jailbroken uh when i'm live streaming hey do you know the playstation 4 4.5 software update has already been jailbroken so expect a, a patch really soon and if you do see a patch i'll give you guys an update on it most likely it's gonna say uh that that it's just updating the hardware so so that way you get a better experience they're never gonna uh shine the light on the fact that um it's already been hacked and it's already been jailbroken which is pretty nuts i mean uh <laughs> you know but anyways that's it for me enough of me rambling on if you would take two seconds out of your day hit a like that really helps me out if you guys haven't already subscribed that would be awesome as well remember to check the link in the video description for those external hard drives if you want those and also really quickly i am launching my monkeyflop.com website again it's not completely up and running i just launched it. it it hasn't been up for a long time so a lot of the stuff on there is like old and i just have playlists um so whenever i add another a new video on my youtube channel it automatically uploads but i love to hear you guys thoughts and opinions on what i should put on my uh, monkeyflop.com website um i know i've gotten some feedbacks from uh some twitter followers which thank you very much i'm definitely considering your guys's uh feedback on it but what would you want to see on my website um you know it's, it's pretty much open to anything i think uh as far as gaming news we're gonna stick to youtube uh as far as like um uh, getting the news out there i think we're gonna stick to youtube but uh we can create some some um pages if you will um uh, but you know i just i want to get some ideas from you uh but anyways enough of me rambling on like i said i'll see you guys in the next news update